Good evening, everybody. How are you today? Good evening, Hello. teacher. Okay. Good, evening, good teacher. evening, Good evening. It's good to have you here, my dear participants. Uh, today, we are going to continue with uh, our English class, right? I'm very happy to have you here back in class. And um, first of all, I want to say that this is our uh, third week, right? So to, uh, for this week, we are going to develop section number four. And for next week, we are going to develop section number five and the final exam, okay? Before we can continue with the class, I would like to ask you if you have had the chance to go to the platform and if you have had any difficulty. Um, because I have been supporting some people, but not all of you have a, Written, so I expect that all of you are okay with the platform. So I would like to know. Because for today, we expect to have finished section number three, including the midterm exam. So mm -hmm. I would like to know who like has yeah, everything yeah, yeah. okay? Everything okay with the platform? Yo llegué ya a las okay. cuatro. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, okay. Este, yo ya llegué a la sección 4 y me quedé en el ejercicio 4 o 3, creo. Okay. Okay, perfect. So it's okay because you are even a little bit more advanced of uh, what we expect, right? Okay, excellent. So uh, let me share with you my presentation that I have for you tonight. So in order that we can talk the same ideas. So I would like to ask you, can you watch my screen? Yes, yes. teacher. Yes, yes teacher. teacher. Okay, perfect. So let me expand my view in order that you can... Okay, let me... Okay, very good. So as I said before, uh, today we are going to study the lesson four, uh, so let me see what is happening. Okay, right. Okay, uh, 4.0 objective that says by the end of this class, you will learn vocabulary related to the food pyramid. You will also learn how to express the food that you like and dislike, right? And uh, if you go to the platform, you will see that you have there the food pyramid and you have several vocabulary of different foods so that's the, that's the first class, the first part of the class that we are going to study today. And then if time allow us, we are going to continue with the 4.2 uh, that says by the end of this class, you will learn count and non-count nouns, right? Additionally, um, you will learn how to use the expression some and any, okay? And then you have there a vocabulary extra in the platform. And let me see, uh, there we will go to the knowledge check, but we are going to stop sharing, right? Uh, so this is the part we are going to study today. And then let me see. Okay, uh, I would like that you can confirm if you can watch my screen. Can you watch my new screen, my dears? Pueden ver mi nueva pantalla ahora? Hola, hola. No, teacher. No, hola, pueden ver. No, teacher. Okay, so let me share again. Sí. It's okay now? Ahora sí? No, teacher. No, no, sí. Que una parte. Okay, ahora sí, ¿verdad? Ahora sí todos. Okay. Perfect. So uh, basically we are going to, to talk about the food. So we are going to talk about a uh, breakfast, for example, and then we are going to develop some, I said some vocabulary because there's a lot of vocabulary uh, for this topic. So uh, for example, for breakfast, we have a uh, mermaid, we have a uh, hum, coffee, egg, bread, breakfast cereal, we have sausages, orange juice, milk, cheese, tomatoes, waffles, bacon, breakfast burrito, 
we have a uh, porridge, uh, donuts, muffins, pancakes, breakfast, and sandwiches. We have here some toast, uh, milk, and yogurt. So if you see, it's a very American, uh, it's a very American uh, breakfast. So in El Salvador, we eat a little bit different, right? So, um, but I will present the vocabulary I have, and then we are going to work a little bit with our preferences because uh, in this class, we are going to learn how to express our likes and dislikes in addition to the food vocabulary. Then for dinner, we can have fried chicken, omelet, pizza, fish, steak, dressing, toast salad, soup, rice, um, meat. Um, in this case, it's fish. And then we have some uh, grilled uh, meat. Here we have some fruits. Uh, so many people like the fruit, but some others uh, dislike. So we are going to talk about this a little bit later. In the fruits, we have apples. So let me expand because we have many of them. Uh, can you watch it? Hello. Yes. Okay, perfect. Yes, teacher. Okay, we yes, have teacher. apple, nectarine, watermelon. Yes, Excellent. Apple, nectarines, watermelon, oranges, pears. Uh, we have there some strawberries, uh, cherries, pomegranates, mangoes, papaya, blueberry, uh, jackfruit, kiwi, peaches, pineapples, bananas, plums. Uh, grapes, carambola in the UK, star fruit in the US, apricot, raspberries, mandarins, or can be tangerines also, grapefruit, lemon, limes, melon, coconuts, avocado, peaches, and kiwi. And we have here for uh, some time for dinner, many people uh, look for fast food like hamburgers cheeseburger, sandwich, milkshake, muffins, burrito, biscuits, we say biscuits in the UK and we say cookies in the US, taco, right? We can have some donuts, fried chicken, hot dog, pizza, chips. In the UK, they call them chips. In the US, we, they call them fries, right? Uh, pretzels, onion rings, sausages, pancakes, bacon. So here is one interesting part. We express what we like and what we don't like, what we love and what we hate. It's like the opposite, right? I can say, I like fruit, but I dislike, or I don't like fast food. I love, uh, for example, let's see. Um, some people can say, I love chicken, but I hate fish, for example. I'm just saying an example. Uh, so, today we are going to talk about what I like, what I don't like, and what I love or what I hate. So here, I have an example for you. What do you like to eat for breakfast? If you ask me, I can say, for breakfast, I like to eat beans, eggs, coffee, and bread. And if you ask me, what do you like to eat for lunch, maybe I will answer, for lunch, I like to eat salad, rice, fish, and grapes. And if you ask me, what do you like to eat for dinner? I say, for dinner, I like to eat pupusas or tamales or any other uh, traditional food uh, from El Salvador. Okay, so now is your turn to practice. And I would like to ask you if you can tell us what do you like to eat uh, for breakfast, for lunch, and for dinner. So since we are just a few right now, I would like to ask every one of you at least once. Me gustaría que cada uno responda por lo menos una vez, ¿verdad? Eh, ¿Qué le gustaría comer? Eh, so we are going to start eh, one by one. So um, I would like to ask to Adonai Portillo. Adonai, what do you like to eat for breakfast? Uh, good evening, teacher. Well, uh, for breakfast, uh, uh, maybe with the, the Monday to Friday, 
my okay. breakfast is a bread and cheese, one uh, one coffee. And for the weekends, maybe pupusas. Okay, excellent. Thank you, Adonai. Thank you very good. Uh, very much. You're very good uh, in your participation. Uh, Vladimir Romero, what would you like to eat for lunch in this case? For lunch. Uh, for lunch. Uh, yeah. Oops, for lunch, I like to eat um, a, a chicken fried, fried chicken. Fried chicken, uh huh. Uh, uh, fried chicken and a rice. Mm -hmm. e fresh, uh, fresh salad. Okay, thank you. Excellent. <laughs> only, only that. Okay, thank you very much. Eli Ayala, what would you like to eat for dinner? Hello, Eli, are you there? Can you hear me? Hello. Hello, my uh, dear. For dinner, I like. Hello. Hello. We are hearing you now. Hello. Hello, my dear. Now Hello. we can listen to you. Uh, for, for dinner, I like to. I'm back, I'm sorry. Uh, you were saying, my dear, that for dinner you like? Could you repeat again, please? Hello. Hello. Hello, Ellie. You were saying that for dinner you like? Hello. Hello, my dears. I'm back. Hello, my dears. I'm back. I'm, I'm having some internet problems. No, 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 Adelante. Una pregunta. Adelante. Una pregunta. Sí, en estos momentos. Hay otras personas que solo le avisaban, pero le identifico que en el momento que él estaba dando la clase, una de sus hijas estaba viendo Netflix. Entonces desconectó todo y hubo este problema. Bueno, una hora, digo yo, ¿verdad? para que no hola. tengamos eso, esos inconvenientes. Hola, hola, hola. perdón, Abdul, no le, escuché. no le escuché lo que me decía. Hola. Ah, le decía que muy probablemente me escucha. Sí, ahora sí le escucho. Bueno, hemos, hemos reiniciado el router. Cuénteme. Y pendientes. Para que tal vez si, si hace la prueba y que se desconecten, probablemente está este, este, este error de conexión. Hola, Abdul. Fíjense que nosotros tenemos... No, hola, hola. ¿Me escuchan ahora? Sí, sí, hola, sí. Hola, perfecto. Fíjense que hemos reiniciado el router para ver si eso mejora la señal, ¿verdad? Eh, para ver que ya no se caiga de nuevo. ¿Me pueden escuchar? ¿Hola? ¿Hola, hola? Ahora sí me escuchan. Vaya. Oh, perfecto, voy a, compartir, sí, sí, perfecto. voy a compartirles de nuevo. Sí, fíjense que eh, está dando un pro, eh, ciertos problemitas la conexión en la zona y a veces nos toca eh, reiniciar los routers para, para volver a, a la señal original. Es una falla del proveedor, lastimosamente da cada cierto tiempo. Entonces, ahí las disculpas del caso. Voy a, a compartirles de nuevo la pantalla. Su internet es Tigo, Lick. No, fíjese que no. Este, el proveedor es al net, es inalámbrico. Ah. Eh, ajá, es por eso le digo que es una falla, porque no, no, es, eh, no es de siempre que lo da, ¿verdad? De hecho, los días anteriores no hemos tenido ningún problema, pero sí hemos detectado que cada cierto tiempo da, da la falla. Bueno, espero que ahora ya no, ya no, ya no nos desconecte, ¿verdad? Estábamos en la práctica y estábamos hablando 
uh, the what you like and dislike, right? Yes. So I I said what I like and Ellie was saying what she likes, verdad? Entiendo que le gusta. What she likes for dinner? Que le gusta para yes. Okay, Ellie. Uh, can you excuse us and say us say? Uh, Mm -hmm. uh, for dinner, I like to eat papaya and yogurt. Would you like for dinner? Hello? Hello? For dinner, you say you like? Uh, papaya and yogurt. Ah, so you have a very dietetic and nutritional ah. uh, uh, food, right? Excellent. Very good. Uh, so, let's see. Uh, yes. My dear, <laughs> excellent, that's good, that's healthy for you. My dear Abdul Gonzalez, what would you like to eat for breakfast? Uh, yes, for, bre for breakfast, I like uh, two pupusas. To eat, to eat pupusas. Beans. <laughs> Uh, to, eat, uh, to eat pupusas, mm -hmm. to eat uh, beans, eggs, bread. Excuse me, I heard pup pupusas uh, breakfast. Uh, you said uh, pupusas, uh, uh, beans, eggs, eggs, uh -huh, uh, and bread. And always, always, always coffee. <laughs> yes, always is, is impossible, right? Without vitamin C, we say vitamin C, right? Okay, very good. So, I'm sorry, my dears. Okay, um, let's continue with, let's see, uh, Morenita, Nicole. Nos aparece como Nicole Morenita. Good, good evening. Good evening, my dear. I like to eat for lunch. Mm -hmm. For lunch, it's okay. Good evening. You can say for lunch, it's okay. I like to eat for lunch. Uh, yeah. Uh, chicken, mm -hmm. uh, rice, mm -hmm. uh, green salad, mm -hmm. um, uh, uh, sometimes uh, juice, natural juice. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. Who else wants to share? ¿Quién más quiere compartir? What do you like to eat? Only. Okay, mm -hmm. thank you, Morenita. Let's see, Carlos. Carlos, what do you like to eat for dinner? I don't know if Carlitos is there. No. Uh... Mira, apagame ella, Hello. Hello, Carlitos. Hello, hello. El monitor y el... Solo déjenme ver que tengo el... una no, pequeña interferencia por acá. Uh, ok, creo que ya, ya la superamos. Eh, ok, Carlitos, what, Trinca, would you like... what would you like to eat? Okay. Tal vez si los demás me ayudan en poner en mute, sí, chicos, ahí. mientras Carlitos... I like to eat for... Teacher, the okay, Carlitos, I was saying thank you because I just heard part of what you say, but thank you so much. Um, I would like to see Cindy Alvarez. Cindy, what do you like to eat for, for um, let's see, hey, hey. breakfast? Faltó, falté, faltaba, faltaba, Car teacher. Adelante, Carlitos, yes. adelante. Yes, uh, I like to eat for dinner and beans. Mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. Cheese and bread, um, chocolate or coffee. Oh, nice. I love chocolate also. Yes. Okay, Carlito, thank you very much. Okay, let's see. Welcome. We are going to finish with Cindy. What would you like to eat for um, lunch, Cindy? I don't know if Cindy is there. Okay, if not, let's see. 
Joao Portillo, what would, would you like to eat for lunch, Joao? Uh, I like to eat um, fish, uh -huh. um, eggs, mm -hmm. uh, well, este, perdón, es, este, beans, mm -hmm. fish, and ensalada, ¿cómo se dice? Salad. Salad. And salad. And salad, thank you. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, my dears. Basically, you have said what you like to eat and what... Uh, that's that's good but now i will i would like to share with you my screen and i have other expressions that i would like that you can that you that you know for example uh, you can say i like when you like something a lot you can say i love when you like but the most you can say i enjoy right enjoy uh, you can say i prefer if you prefer something instead of other thing, I dislike what you really don't like. I uh, use, it's similar to say don't like. Hate, when something it's impossible for you, you don't like it and you detest, you detest it, right? You say loathe uh, when you, it's something that scares you. For example, you can say, I like burgers, I love chocolate, I enjoy swimming. I prefer football to rugby. I dislike apples. I don't like horror films, films, right? And so on. And you can say also, I hate cheese. I detest spiders. I loathe beetle, uh, beetles, right? So uh, that's the new vocabulary that I have for you. And I would like that you can take a picture of it. I will send it to you. Vamos a enviarles una imagen para que lo puedan utilizar. Uh, that's the new vocabulary to express likes and dislikes, right? And then we are going to have an exercise in a breakout room. So let me see if I can improve this image. If you can take a picture, it's okay. Si usted le puede tomar una imagen, mucho que mejor. So let me see. Let me send it to you. Vamos a enviar la imagen. And the idea is that you can talk about what you like and what you don't like, right? Uh, for eating, taking as basis the vocabulary we already have been discussing, right? But I would like that you can advance a little bit and I would like to ask you, can you watch my new screen? Pueden ver mi nueva pantalla? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. In this case, what we are going to do, if you see here, we have, a, it says, do you like? That's the expression to ask if you like something. Do you like? And it says, pair word, express your likes and dislikes. Likes says lo que te gusta and dislikes lo que no te gusta. On the following topics. First, study the given example. For example, if we can talk about pop music, horror films, Shopping, cooking, rehash hamo, eh, cricket, pet dogs, um, Chinese bikes, washing uh, clothes, learning different languages, for example, uh, getting up early, walking in the rain, meeting new people, eating out, right? Eating out means going to a restaurant, right? Uh, looking after children, it's like taking care of children, no matter if they are your children or the children of other people. Uh, donating money is, for example, when people ask you uh, if you can help with some specific, um, uh, let's see, support, for example, right? Uh, and here it's, uh, the conversation goes like this. For example, one person asks, excuse me, one person asks, uh, do you like pop music? For, mu music, for example, I can say, do you like pop music? Do you like romantic music? Do you like, I don't know, uh, jazz music? Uh, another person says, no, I don't like it very much. You can say, I don't like it very much. Es como, no me gusta mucho, ¿verdad? Uh, do you, ese do you es como, y tú, ¿verdad? 
eh, a mí no me gusta mucho, pero do you y tú? And you can say, yes, I love it. A mí sí, ¿verdad? Me encanta. Ese yes, I love it es sí, me encanta. Me gusta mucho, ¿verdad? Do you like getting up early in the morning? It's a very tricky question. I don't mind getting up early. Ese I don't mind es como no me molesta levantarme temprano. What about you? Es como no es que me guste, pero tampoco me molesta, ¿verdad? It's like I can live with it. Puedo vivir con eso, ¿verdad? If I have to. Si tengo que, ¿verdad? And uh, you say, um, I don't mind getting up early. What about you? This, that what about you is uh, like giving back the question to you. Es como devolviéndole la pregunta, ¿verdad? So, um, the other person says, I hate getting up early. Es como odio, ¿verdad? Detesto, no me gusta para nada eh, levantarme temprano. So, uh, basically, what I'm asking to you is to go to the breakout rooms now and try to answer to these questions. Not the same questions, but I would like that you can uh, take, for example, uh, some examples from here. For example, pop music, horror films, shopping, cricket, uh, maybe pet dogs, uh, washing clothes, or you can change the activities, right? Those that I have here are just an example for you. You can take them or you can replace with others. I don't know if you have questions. Eh, me gustaría saber si tienen preguntas del ejercicio. Ok, eh, asumo okay. que no, ¿verdad? Entonces lo que vamos a hacer es, vamos a ir a los pequeños salones y vamos a, a tratar de armar una pequeña conversación en tríos o en pares, como nos corresponda. Eh, vamos a tomar como guía estas actividades que tenemos aquí y básicamente vamos a tratar de construir una conversación con base a estas eh, expresiones, ¿verdad? I like, I love, I enjoy, I prefer, I dislike, I don't like, I hate, I detest, I loathe. And uh, you can express yourself because it's your own decision, is your likes and dislikes. Usted puede expresar, ¿verdad? Lo que le gusta, lo que no le gusta, porque es una... It's a personal opinion. Es una opinión personal. Okay, so let me go and stop sharing. And now, I have already sent to you the, the images, so I expect that all of you can have them in, the, in your WhatsApp group. So we are going to have five groups, basically, of uh, three people. So I would like to invite you to join now when you receive the invitation, please. Hacemos una pregunta y en base a eso la, la respondemos. Ah, me, es perfecto. O sea, creo que cada ah. quien una pregunta y la ah. respondemos todos lo que nos gusta. ¿Cuál es parte que you like? Uh, eh, Adonai. I enjoy the football soccer. Me too, but 
Only see. <laughs> no practice. <laughs> That's okay. Me too. <laughs> yeah. Um, Cindy? What Hi. about you? Este, vamos a poner lo que él dijo. Si quiere, ¿Primero? si quiere, si, si quiere volvemos a poner la pregunta para que todos vayamos en sintonía y la escribimos, si quieren, y ahí vamos poniendo la respuesta. Ajá. ¿Cómo mencionó la pregunta, bueno? What sport do you like? Ah, ok, what sport. ¿Cómo? What sport do you like? Ah, se me trabó el internet. Thank you. Oh, you like. ¿Y cuál fue la respuesta de... Horror movies. Do you like horror movies, teacher? Hello, no. <laughs> I am scared about uh, horror movies. I lose uh, like this. <laughs> <laughs> I like. Do you like romantic movies? I like romantic movies. Movies, excuse me, and I like comedy because it makes uh, me laugh a lot, and I finish at the end with a stomachache of laughing but uh -huh. for, for me it's like a um, anti-stress therapy right uh, so yes. when, when i'm very very stressed what i like to do what i love to do is to just mm. breathe, sit down and look for a, just a little bit time to watch something that makes me laugh and laugh and laugh and that's like poof calm down <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> thank you for asking I see you working very hard. Very good. I love Thank that. Thank you, good. Okay, very good. I will go to see the other group how they are going, right? Okay. Right. Okay. Thank you for sharing with me. See you in a minute. See you in a minute. Okay. Hello, Monica. Can you hear me? Hello, hello, Monica. Hello, Monica. Welcome to class. Can you hear me? Okay. Hey, Raquel, um, I am fine. Oh. And you? I'm fine. Um, do you like... ¿Qué le puedo preguntar? Vamos a ver. Horror films. Ah, okay. Justo eso estaba viendo. Do you like horror films? Film? Um, I like. Yes, I like Annabelle. Oh, <laughs> Ay, no. <laughs> okay. Um, y do you like getting um, in the night? significan uy ya no llaman no 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 yet todavía no chicos todavía no at, oh. at night <laughs> cuando quiero decir que en la noche at night, at night because uh, at I, night. I'm afraid of that at night es como eso me da miedo uh, en la noche verdad right ah uh, uh, okay yeah yes sí. okay excellent do you have questions <laughs> ¿Tenemos preguntas sobre la conversación? ¿New words? No, no. I know. Ok, perfecto. No. I'll, I'll go to the next group and I'll call you like in a minute and a half, right? So you can continue practicing. Thank you. You're welcome, my dears. Y en la última... Así en, en cosas de deporte. Uh, hello. Is everything okay? How is it going? Do you have questions? Sí, teacher, que es Rajesh Hamal. Fíjese que es como, eh, ahorita les digo, yo también entré en duda con eso cuando lo vi. Es algo como hindú, pero ya ahorita les digo. Sí, porque por lo menos yo lo estaba poniendo en el pero traductor. Es como una fiesta, ¿verdad? 
Ajá. No, es, es algo, este, es algo más Una com eh, como folclórico, como, como, le digo, mm. como propio. Como, es como una, una fiesta. De es, una, es un actor cinematográfico. Si usted solo le pone Rajesh ah. Ra Ra Hamal, Ay, no. es un actor. <risa> con, con razón. Es un proper noun. He's an actor. <risa> ya. <Yeah. Yeah. risa> eh, it says, es un actor de cine en nepalí. Ya ve que le decía que era similar a hindú. Ah. Ajá, sí. Ah. Y en este caso, teacher... Uh -huh. Para decir que no, no lo conocemos, cuando, si nos están preguntando que nos gusta. We don't know him. We don't know mm. him. No lo conocemos a él. Ok. Ok. Uh, it says Thank that you. From Thank you. Ok. You're welcome. Ok. okay. Are you about to finish? Because we just have one minute to come back to the plenary session. Ok. So okay. I call you in a minute, okay? Okay. 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 Hello, my dear Daisy, how are you? Welcome to class, Daisy. Otra. <laughs> Hello, how is it going? Do you like right? Do you Hello, like right? Teacher. Hello, teacher. <laughs> teacher. Hello. ¿Cómo Ten. podemos decir? ¿Cómo podemos decir? Te gusta manejar pero en trayectos largos. Do you like to drive long distances? <laughs> I hate. I hate drive long distance. I detest. Oh do wow. Like, do you like drive? Long. Do you like to to drive? Do you like to drive long distances? Yeah. I question. detest. Drive. And then you say I detest. I detest. I detest. Teacher, for you, know? do you like eat pacaya? No. <laughs> Look, I, I will tell you. <laughs> I'll tell you a story. I hate pacaya in the past because it's too bitter, right? But my husband taught me how to eat it, and now I like it. Rellenos. <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> just because of love, only for that. Yo creo que con, con, esta, con esta pregunta que le voy a hacer, solo alguien va a decir que sí. A ver. Okay. Do, do you like to go to the shopping? To, to walk? Go to, the Go to the shopping. Shopping. Uh, I, uh, <laughs> I, I well think... done low. <laughs> you can say it depends. It depends. <laughs> Sometimes um, you don't like to go shopping with, with us because you say that we stay a lot of time shopping and at the end we don't shop anything. <laughs> <risa> ah, no, oh, teacher, ¿cómo sería? ¿Te gusta acompañar a alguien de compras? Porque a veces eso es como que un poco. Yes, it's like boring. Para, it's para boring. La... Es aburrido. It's boring. Right? Yeah, yes. I know. You can say, do you like uh, to go shopping with? With a friend, with your girlfriend, and etc. No, eh. right? <risa> <risa> ok. Excelente. Dijo, do you like to go shopping? To go shopping with. To go with shopping with your friend. Uh, do you like to go shopping with a friend, uh, with your girlfriend, with your spouse, <coughs> right? With your wife, with your daughter. It depends with the person, right? Or you can say, if you don't know the person, you can say, do you like to go shopping with other person or with someone else? Este es someone else, es como con alguien más. Y la mm -hmm. otra, ah, okay. with other person, con otra persona. Si usted no sabe con quién, ¿verdad? Simplemente deja la pregunta abierta. ¿Te gusta ir de compras con otra persona o con alguien más? Ok. Ok, mm -hmm. okay my dears. Uh, so, I'm going to invite you to come back to the plenary session in one minute, ok? So, we are going to okay. share the, the conversation okay. we have, ok? Excelente. Okay. okay. Aquí va una, compañeros. Do you like...
Hello, hello, welcome back, my dears. I see you're coming back from the uh, breakout rooms. I hope you have had a nice time by practicing the food vocabulary or any other items to talk about what you like and what you don't like. We are going just to wait for a couple of minutes for people to come back, just 26 seconds and people will be back. Okay, it's good to have you here back, my dear participants. I would like to know who would like to share what you like, what you don't like, right? So uh, I would like you can tell me uh, how was your conversation about? Uh, you can tell us to the class. Me gustaría que le pudieran compartir a la clase voluntariamente eh, de qué hablaron en el breakout room y si alguien quiere presentar la conversación. If you would like to perform the conversation. I'll need some volunteers. Yeah. Okay, maybe Adonai. Adonai for team and team. Okay, teacher. For uh, for this time, my group and me uh, uh, prepare about three questions about the the works. Okay. Okay. Please go ahead and tell us what were the questions and the answers. Oh, okay. For the first is um. What sports do you like? Mm -hmm. um, Morena, um, and I say, I like football soccer. Morena says, me too, but not practice. Uh, I don't practice. practice. I, I don't, don't practice. practice. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, Cindy don't like the, doesn't. the football. Cindy doesn't, doesn't like. Doesn't soccer. like the uh, football soccer, but prefer mm -hmm. basketball. Okay. She prefers. Or, she prefers. She prefers, she prefers the, the basketball. Uh -huh. uh, for the second, what is your favorite food? Uh, Morena says uh, he, uh, she loves the beans <laughs> and fish. And okay. I, in my case, I don't like the fish. Okay. And Cindy, she loves the pizza and pupusas. Okay, yeah. excellent. <laughs> and what else? For, and for the third, um, do you like to cook him? In my case, to, uh, cook, to cook, to cook, to cook. Mm -hmm. In my case, I love it for only the weekends because I uh, only I have time the weekends. For Morena, she she say only the weekends too. Okay. And Cindy, uh, she like it, but sometimes. That's it. Excellent. Thank you, Adonai, for participating in the group and for sharing uh, this summary of what you talk about and your likes and dislikes as group members. Thank you very much. Okay, okay, who else? I need another team. Maybe, let's see. Let's see, let's see. De nosotros. Okay, please, please, Abdul, go ahead, my dear. Thank you. Eh, vaya, nuestra, nuestras preguntas. Solo, teacher, fíjense que, de hecho, decíamos con los compañeros que para nosotros el término soccer no es, no es fútbol. Porque en realidad el soccer vino bien de los gringos. Entonces, sí. para nosotros, si es fútbol, es fútbol. Pero si es fútbol americano, nosotros decimos fútbol americano. Entonces, eso a mí no me gusta usar el término soccer. Antes. Yeah, it's a little Papá. bit confusing. Uh, because here we understand uh, fútbol, right? Uh, but if you say fútbol in the U.S., they understand the other sport, right? The American. Yeah. Exacto. Exactly. Yeah. So it depends on, on the context. It depends on the context that you need to clarify. For example, the, the uh, Adonai said uh, football soccer, right? He clarified uh, in this case, but it, normally when you say football in, in Latin America, they understand that you are talking about the, the, the traditional uh, balón pie, right? Okay. Ah, okay. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Vaya, uno de mis compañeros me va a responder, no sé quién de los le, dos. Le, le ayudo yo si quiere, no hay problema. Ah, 
Ah, no, yo, yo voy a preguntar y usted responde. <risa> ok. Ok, ok, that's right. Do you like eat pacaya? <risa> no, I don't like, I don't like. Eh, Carlos creo que igual. Eh, he, I, I hate. I hate. I hate. No, 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 I don't sorry, like. Sorry, sorry, other sorry. Question, sorry other like. question. Okay. Other question. Okay. Like to drive long distance? No. I, I hate. Like. I hate drive I long distance. I detest. I detest. Uh, okay. <laughs> only, only, only two, two okay. questions. No more. Only two questions. No more than two questions. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay. I, I like that you have a lot of fun by asking this question. Thank you very much. Okay, I need a third team. Necesitamos un tercer equipo que quiera eh, contestarnos that, that uh, would like to perform, right? Is that my group? Okay. Yeah, please go ahead. Okay. Eh, quizás le vamos a preguntar a Vicky. Okay. Do you like uh, movie horror horror movie? To watch. Do, no. You can say ah, to watch. online. Ah, sí. ah, to, ah, watch. to watch horror movie. Sí. Okay. No, I don't like. Okay. Te te quiero preguntar una. <laughs> okay. okay. You can ask to like um, now. Okay. Do you like cooking? Yes, I like. Cook. Uh -huh. uh, cook. Like. Okay, excellent. Okay. And who else was in your team? ¿Quién más estaba en su equipo? Uh, estaba, ¿cómo se llama? <laughs> Me olvidó. To ask a third question, para preguntar una, hacer una tercera pregunta. Sí. Uh, uh -huh. Repórtese la que estaba conmigo. <laughs> Pero no. no. <laughs> Okay, uh, is there someone else in Vladimir's team that would like to participate? ¿Hay alguien más en el equipo de Vladimir? Okay. Sí, sí. había alguien más. Pero... Había alguien más. Sí, sí había alguien más, sí. pero no me acuerdo. Quién okay. Era. Okay, don't worry. It's okay. Lo Thank siento. you, Vladi and Vicky, for sharing. Okay, I need an extra group, a volunteer uh, of another group, because we were five groups. Éramos cinco grupos, así que me hace falta todavía un grupo más, dos grupos más. Let's see. Veamos. No sé si el equipo de Joao, sí, ya estuvo, ¿verdad? Creo que yes, teacher, yes. Joao estaba con Abdul, creo. Correcto, ver, correcto. Vicky, con Vladimir, el equipo de... Carlita Salazar, no sé si ya, ya participó. No, teacher. Ok, please go ahead, Carlita, adelante. <laughs> This is your moment okay. to speak. Recuerden que este es su momento para hablar, ¿verdad? I speak less, yo hablo menos. <laughs> ok. Eh, nosotros repasamos, eh, do you like pop music? Uh -huh. eh, yes, I like... Um, a Vladimir eh, sí, igual sí, era cool. <laughs> like pero más en English okay en Spanish okay um, English English pop English pop music yes okay eh, a, a Vicky eh, yes en en, en lo, two two languages en, en los dos lenguajes en, en los dos idiomas in, in both languages okay both eh, ambos uh -huh. ambos sí Do, uh, do you like horror films? No, I don't not like. I don't like. Uh, okay. I don't like. Uh, 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 Vladimir, yes, yes, I like. Vladimir said uh, that, yes, that yes, she like, she likes it. She like, sí. Okay. Um, no sé si Vladimir quiere participar. Vladimir. Hola. <laughs> no. Sí. Hello, would you like to say uh, something about it? Sí, um, quiero, uh, do you like wearing in the rain? Walking, walking in the rain? Yeah. Carla? Carlita, do you like walking in the rain? <laughs> yes. Yes. I walk in the rain. Okay. I, I like, you say. I like. Okay. Okay. 
Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, who was the, the team number five? Do we have a number five team? Nosotros, Luis? teacher. Okay, go ahead, my dears. Con Yanari y Luis. Okay, Yanari and Luis, please go ahead. Adelante. Okay, Yanari, do you like it, Chori? Tú, tú y Chori. Yes, I love it. Do you? Yes, I love it. <laughs> uh, who was? Uh, Luis, uh, do you like horror movies? Yes, I like it. Uh, Miguel, do you like Chinese food? Yes, I like it, but prefer Japanese food. But I prefer, I. But I prefer yeah. Japanese food. Okay. Um, Luis, do you like shopping? Go uh, shopping. Do you like to go shopping? To go shopping? No, I don't. No, I don't like. I don't like it. Like it. Yeah. And Janar? Um, I don't mind shopping, but I prefer stay at home. Okay. Uh, when you use the verb, thank you, my dear. Thank you very much. When you use the verb prefer, you can say, but I prefer staying at home, right? You can okay. use the ing or to stay at home, right? Mm -hmm. Excellent, my dears. Congratulations. Thank you very much for participating and for telling us about your likes and dislikes. Uh, because of the time, we are going to stop the class here for tomorrow. We are going to focus on countable and uncountable nouns. And basically what we will do is to use the same vocabulary we used uh, for food. And we are going to continue learning in how to identify countable and uncountable and how to use them uh, in daily life conversations. Thank you very much for coming. I hope you're safe. Remember that if you have any uh, request uh, of support, you can write to the chat and I will try to support you as, as fast as I can, okay? Okay, teacher. Thank you okay, for Okay, my help. dear. Thank, thank you, you. For, for everything. Thank Take you. care. Bye bye. Thank See you. you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night, teacher. Bye bye. Bye. -bye. bye. bye. bye.